Hi folks, we are in Maui and it's a very exciting day because Lisa is gonna fly for the first time. She's gonna fly today. And so Lawrence is giving her her training and her briefing right now. I stepped away because I don't want to interrupt their briefing, but it's really exciting because Lisa, after years, is going to fly herself. You can put on your headsets. Clear. TJ and Lisa, and we are going to be doing a flight to Molokai. It's your first flight today, as TJ was mentioning. You might notice that the cockpit panel is a little bit different than TJ's airplane. This is a G3 Apodyne. So what we're going to do now is we're going to go to our checklist, and up before takeoff checklist. And those of you that uh, are just tuning in here, uh, my YouTube channel is in the left seat on YouTube, and you can see a lot of uh, serious uh, videos we're going to be discussing. And, uh, Lisa, a little bit of angle of attack today. We're going to Molokai, um, and uh, Molokai is the island next to Maui. So you're going to find she knows enough to be dangerous. She's going to ask you all kinds of questions. Oh, that's great. I love questions. Yes. Not a problem. Uh, believe it or not, your, this video that he's making, it's going to really, it's going to be watched by hundreds of serious lives. Okay. Um, because you're not alone. And um, uh, so this is a, a really good tutorial for them. Okay, very good. So we've been cleared to take off, and um, he's told us that he wants us to extend uh, the departure a little bit because he's got a couple of army helicopters in the direction that we want to be at. All right, so I'm just adding a little bit of break here to get us lined up with the center line. Hands going to be underneath yours on the throttle, and we're going to line up here. Okay, so we so let's go ahead and start bringing in full power. Oh, this one's beautiful. Yes. All right. All right. We're going to cross check uh, the engine and trickle. Everything looks good. Airspeed is alive. We're waiting for 70 knots. And take your left hand and pull back half an inch to an inch. A little bit wide. Oh, yeah. Oh, wide. Oh, wide. Oh, wide. There you go. You got it. Oh, wide. 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 Just push a little bit forward. Just push just a little bit forward. There you go. Yeah, that's it. In fact, what we'll do... Yeah. You can stay in this direction. That was a very nice takeoff, actually. We're going to be running around 65% power and 12.5 gallons down. Fuel in Hawaii, as of this filming, is $8.60 a gallon. Wow. I know, it's crazy. Are we going to right now? I hope so. Yeah, that in the, in the car, too. <laughs> 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 Molokai, where we're flying right now, is uh, about a million and a half years ago, there was a massive earthquake and landslide. Sheared the northern cliff of Molokai into the sea, causing a tsunami 2,000 feet high, covering the island of Lanai, and, uh, and thus creating also the tall sequence on Earth. But what we're going to do first is we're going to fly in between these two big rocks, just like they did in the opening scene of Jurassic Park 3. Once we fly between the rocks, you'll turn right and we're going to parallel the shoreline. There will be a little bit of a, just a kind of a bump uh, as we pass the wake of that particular rock. Uh, okay. It's not that bad, but just let you know it. All right, you got the controls now. And we're going to aim for, uh, see the lighthouse out there? Yeah. All right, cool. So that's where we're going to be landing. And uh, we'll be doing what's called a left down and the runway right five. So all the turns are going to be to the left. period of uh, Hawaii. The king quarantined 8,000 Hawaiians on this peninsula. They were filled with tents. A Belgian priest by the name of Father Damien volunteered to take care of the lepers here. And uh, he ended up getting the disease himself and he's buried at the top of the crater. The priest that was exhumed by the Pope in 2009, they declared him a saint, so he's not a saint Damien. 
There is a church right over here called St. Columbia's Church, where they built that, I think it was 1872. Okay. Well, the door's won't be uh, entering uh, when traffic went way by. Okay, so as soon as we uh, pass here, then we'll bank. Okay, that's your bank. And I also would like you to start reducing the power, and I'd like you to reduce it to 30% power. Your job is to focus on the outside and the angle of tent. See how the yellow is there? Do you see it? Yeah. Okay, all right. So everything is fine. Just tell us that we're slowing down. Okay? One more quick back. And uh, start your left turn for the downwind. And look at the runway as you turn. What we want to do is parallel that runway. It's about what's going to that one. Runway 5, call them. So we're going to keep things super simple. I don't want to information saturate you, so I'm actually going to dip this green. Oh, they don't need it. And here's your power setting now. Okay. Okay. Short. <laughs> so what we're gonna do now, we're gonna turn up base like I'm gonna give you full flaps or uh cross check with the wider, full flaps, four clicks forward. Oh. Good. Alright, great. Now what I want you to do is I want you to reduce the power to twenty percent and also start your left turn. Right, so reduce the power, two clicks back. It'll tell us you turn left base, so run like five call pop. Alright, one more click back, and I want you to look now. Okay, wait, wait, wait. Now, we don't say, uh-oh, with wine. That, that scares everybody. <laughs> okay, look again. Look at that. You're the blue dog. All right, now, let, let go. Look at this. You have your plane trimmed perfectly. It's not that difficult. Now, we just make small tweaks, okay? All right, we're a little bit on the low side because we extended our downwind here, so we're going to just hold off a little bit on our altitude. I want you to look at the runway. It'll tell us you on the left base. And... Behind you on the power. Okay. Everything looks great. I don't see the right way. Um, you see, there's ocean black rocks, there's some tan rocks, and then that's some in strip. Okay, great. Okay, right. All right, now, there's sometimes a little wind shift on the black rocks. Don't worry about it. We'll add power if we get that wind shift. Right now, this is telling us blue donut, we are safe. Everything is great. Your plane is 30% above your stall speed. We're just going to touch of power just because our glide path is a little low. So, that's the instructor's fault. Alright, and now we're going to line up with the center line. So just, all you're focused on is runway and angle of attack. Runway, angle of attack. And we're just going to bring you up a little bit because we're below the glide path here. I can hear all your YouTube critics saying, Oh, look at that, he's not on the glide path. Oh, God. Okay, looking good. Alright, now, I want you to just click for the wind. The wind's going to be variable, okay? So we're going to, uh, See, it's starting to see red and white. It'll do us on final one with time. All right. There it is. So we're going to bring the power back to 20%. Now we're on glide path. Okay? Looking good. And then what I told you, we're going to pretend there's a machine gun on the nose. We're shooting bullets right at runway five, right at the numbers. All right? Next step, and I'll tell you when, we're going to look at those amazing waves on the other side. Uh, next step is I'll tell you we're going to go to 14%, and we're going to touch down with 14% power. Feel the wind? Good thing so. Go ahead. Correct for the wind. Oh, there you go. Oh, there you go. That's it. Small correction. Oh, yeah, that's just one shift. One shift. Okay, now 14%. So start bringing the power back. Now start pulling on the stick. Pull, 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 Ocean, uh, ocean spray here. Oh my god, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna. Hey, you're doing great. Okay. All right. And let's try the left turn. And we're going to climb. Do a left downward. Huh? Oh my god. What about that? That's great. Lisa, you did it. Yeah, you're awesome. And you kind of did it blindfolded because he turned the street on. Yeah. I find that's the easiest way to teach. You know, like, I mean, uh, uh, people are like usually focused on all the technology, you know.
enjoy this video. If you want to see what the YouTube algorithm thinks you will enjoy next, click the video up there. If you want to watch my latest video, click down there. Oh, and don't forget to hit like and subscribe. It really helps the channel.